Thanksgiving just a couple of days away and for the holidays many will look it'll look a lot different this year whether you're skipping the family trip home or maybe you're just eating with a much smaller group like we're doing right here at our GMA3 family Thanksgiving can still happen yes so joining us now looky looky look at who we have with <laughs> us <friend>. our uh, <laughs> ABC News contributor Alicia Quarles here with us and from his home kitchen we have executive chef and partner of Lure Fish Bar and Bowery Meat Company Josh Capon along with his daughter Amanda who's a friend of our show here as well they're going to show us a delicious Thanksgiving recipe so good to see you guys nice to see you guys as well and nothing will ever stop Thanksgiving that's right Josh and you know we've been checking in with you throughout this pandemic and we've been talking about what's happening uh, with the New York City restaurant scene what's the latest on that latest is we're taking it day by day I think right now we're just hoping to get through Thanksgiving and the holidays to be honest with you but you know most importantly my staff is working hard and they're staying healthy and that's all I could ask for especially now yeah we hate days like it's kind of a rainy nasty day and it's tough to get people outside to eat on days like this so that's unfortunate but like you said you're gonna hang in there and Amanda good to see you again you've you've been cooking with your dad I guess dad maybe showed you how to cook but you've been showing dad how to dance I'm told how, how's that been going <laughs> Um, I guess he still has a lot more to learn. Oh, but he's doing oh. well. He's teaching me how to cook as well. Up oh, there it is. Oh my God. <laughs> She's teaching me how to cook, and I'm teaching her how to dance. <laughs> oh, I like the head nice. whip. You see that? <laughs> wow. I like those dance moves. All right, there's no doubt that people are scaling down and keeping it. That was first it take. Uh oh, was that first oh. take? No that was chance. pretty good. No chance. Okay, you got the dance moves down, but the question is, there's no doubt people are scaling down for the holidays. Those big turkeys are out for a lot of us this year, but you have the perfect alternative for a smaller dinner. What are we making, Chef? No, first of all, don't give up on your turkeys, because turkeys make great leftovers, and we, we don't eat them often enough. So don't give up on your turkey, but I'm going to show you how to make something incredible for Thanksgiving or throughout the holidays or any time of year. This is, a, this is what we call a rib roast. Okay, This is a standing rib roast, so it had a bunch of bones in it. But this is a five pound boneless piece of prime rib. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna put an herb garlic coating on it before we cook it. So what do I have here? I have Dijon mustard, shaved garlic, roasted garlic puree, a lot of black pepper. I got a ton of salt in here and pepper, so it's already seasoned. And just with my spatula, what I'm gonna do is create the perfect crust. And if you take your time like Picasso did, you'll get a perfect <laughs> layer. And what you want to do is you want to put this in the fridge for at least a couple hours. The one I cooked today, because I had to get a little head start, I actually cooked, uh, put in the refrigerator last night. You transfer it to a roasting rack. When you're ready to cook it, you take that whole roasting rack and you put it in a 300 degree oven, which I'm kind of going to do now, but I'm going to fake it. You put that in a 300 degree oven for about 20 minutes per pound. It'll get golden brown delicious. And then you're going to have something that looks as beautiful oh, wow. as this right here. I'll throw it up on the cut board, a bag of cutting board. When you bring this to the table, if your guests don't go wild, <laughs> I would just throw them out of the house. Well, everyone here is tasting it. Even just smelling it from the plate is so good. Josh and Amanda, thank you both. We want to wish you and your whole family a very happy Thanksgiving, guys. We're going for the moment of truth. You ready? Look at this. Here we go. Ooh. <laughs> oh. Look at that. I hope you're I hope you're as good as that. But that's what we call the money shot right there. <laughs> Perfectly well rested. A beautiful medium rare. Juicy and delicious. And I hope you guys are enjoying it in the studio as well. Oh, beautiful. Uh, thank you. Well, Chef, thank you so much. And thank you to Amanda as well. But that's a, kind of a main dish there. But I introduced Alicia as our ABC News contributor, but she's also the queen of side dishes, I'm told. Yeah. That's how she should we be heard introduced that. as well. I mean, somebody's teaching y'all well, because that right, is, is so true, Amy <laughs> TJ Jen. All right, who doesn't love the good stuff? Like the green bean casserole and the stuffing. And when it comes to the sides, I've got you covered with a little secret. Here's my go-to for making them into the kitchen. Thanks to our sponsor, Ninja, the sky's the limit with their Foodie 10-in-1 Pro Air Fry Oven. Has an extra large oven capacity and two levels of even cooking. Plus, it helps cut down your cooking time in the kitchen with a 90-second preheat. And get this, it cooks up to 30% faster than your traditional full-size convection oven. Y'all, who doesn't want less kitchen time? 
Uh, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. definitely. Yeah. <laughs> All of us. But the good news does not stop there. The great thing about this oven is that we're giving it away to you guys at home just in time for Thanksgiving. So go to our website for your chance to win your very own Ninja Food XL Pro Air Oven. It's one of my favorites, guys. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.